And we're back with another Marvel Future Fight video. There are going to be a couple new updates with the game, a new hero, a new character, and also they're going to allow more characters to go to Tier 2. It is time to reveal the last two Tier 2 advancement that will be coming in the mini update, which I believe is on the 29th, which is tomorrow. If you missed the last Tier 2 announcement, you can find Vision and Drax, Star-Lord and Rocket Raccoon, and now they're going to allow Gamora and Groot. Groot is one of the best healers in the game, and we want to make sure that he's not overshadowed by other characters and items. We're going to make Groot the fundamental healing character, so now he's going to get apply to all team HP recovery with a certain chance. Gamora needed more damage, but also needs more survivability. She used to be in a great place, and now we want to make Gamora great again. Wow, hashtag right there. Skill damage increase and guaranteed dodge. That is it for the next small update that will be released on 629. Very cool. Now, cooler than that is that they're going to introduce Sharon Rogers. And basically in all the Marvel games right now, they're having a Captain America 75th anniversary. And the first thing I thought is, oh my God, how old is Stan Lee? Stan Lee is like 93 years old. And all the games are getting a unique alternate universe character. Here's a picture of some of the characters that are coming out for the other games. And the one that's coming out for Marvel Future Fight is called Sharon Rogers. And she is the daughter of Peggy Carter and Captain America, which is very strange because in the Civil War timeline right now, his new love interest is Sharon Carter, which is going to be out in the next movie. So that's a little bit confusing to me, and I don't know why they want to call her Sharon, just to get everybody else mixed up with Sharon Carter. But this is another daughter by Peggy, but also the name Sharon. But Sharon Carter... Oh, this makes my head hurt. <laughs> Background information. Alternate universe where Captain America was never frozen in an ice at the end of World War II. Steve Rogers and allied resistance fighter agent Peggy Carter helped win the great confidence and celebrated V-Day with the private marriage ceremony. Certainly after the honeymoon, when Peggy was assigned to South Korea as part of S.H.I.E.L.D. peacekeeping task force, the couple relocated and one year later welcomed the birth of their daughter, Sharon. Decades later, when her father and mother retired from active service, Sharon took up her parents' quest for peace and justice, highly trained in martial arts and espionage, and equipped with a blaster lance and an energy-absorbing seal. Sharon battles evil and tyrants around the world as Captain America, and I gotta tell you, she looks really cool. So, there are some of the stats there. She's gonna have superhuman strength, enhanced recovery, trained martial artist, and she is a spy, and she's gonna have this lance. Okay, well, let me know what you guys think uh, down there in the comment section. I'm excited to get a new hero as usual. Right here in the middle of the screen, there is a link to all of my Marvel Future Fight videos. You can click the link right there. It'll take you to the last video that I just had, and as well as a playlist of all of the videos I have. And I really do appreciate the support. And as always, thanks for watching, and keep on gaming.